guys can see, I already started my foundation. I primed, moisturized, washed my face, did all that. And while I was doing it, I just like, girl, record. You ain't posted in a video. Uh, it's been a while since you posted another video. So yeah, we gonna get into this look and talk about the finals. We're gonna talk, we're gonna do makeup and basketball today. I'm gonna do my makeup while I talk about the NBA finals and what's going on right now and all the sports news. So, yeah. So I'm taking my Fenty foundation. I love this stuff. I love this foundation. This foundation is marvelous. Marvelous. You guys hear me? Marvelous. So let's talk about the last game. Game, was it game three? No, 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 game four. We on game four. All right, let's put no more for you. Yeah. We are at game four. Now, I live in Phoenix, Arizona. So, no, I'm not a Suns fan. I used to be like when St Steve Nash and Lamar started Martin and Sean Marion and Stephon Marbury when they was playing. I was a fan of them. But, you know, over the years, I just, it's whatever. I really don't care to live here, honestly, if we're being completely honest. So, I don't really care, honestly. Brooklyn is out, so I don't really care who wins, but I would like the Suns to win because they never had a championship for one. And for two, have the Suns had a championship? Let me look real quick. No, they have never had a championship. So it would be nice to see, you know, them get a championship mainly Chris Paul because I do like Chris Paul. I really do. He's one of my favorite point guards. So it would be nice to see him get a ring. You know, he been in a game the game for a minute. So he definitely deserves a ring. In my opinion. He definitely deserves a ring. But, but, the way you played last night, you ain't gonna get no ring with that. Not by the way y'all played. Not by the way y'all played. Then I also want the Suns to win because, like I said, Brooklyn is gone. And, of course, the Bucks knocked Brooklyn out. I honestly feel like that's James Harden's fault. We're not putting nothing on Kevin Durant. Don't do my man's, okay? And, and this little joke y'all got going on talking about, oh, because the Suns was winning two, the series was two and zero. And the Suns, you know, they was taxing that ass in the beginning of the series. Y'all gonna put Kevin Durant in the, in the Suns jersey talking about Kevin Durant next year. He don't wanna play for the Suns. Don't do my dude. Don't do not do him. Don't do him. He don't want to play for the Suns. Like, that wasn't even funny. <sighs> Joke is getting old and tired. Come up with something new. And I don't know why my little curls don't want to stay. Like... He don't want to play for the Suns at all. At the Virgo, okay? And I honest, honestly, I don't like Giannis. Like, I don't know. He's a great basketball player. I give him that. But it's just something about him. I just don't, don't like him. But out of all, like, the young bulls, like, he's definitely top three. I am a true basketball fan. 
So if you cold with it, I'm gonna give you your props. I may not like you, but your game is, this is so hard trying to do this in the camera. But if your game is tight, I ain't gonna be no hater. You know, I ain't gonna hate. I ain't gonna play a hate. I'm gonna appreciate. But, but I don't care. But I definitely will give you your props and appreciate. That's like with me and LeBron and Kobe. Like, love what they brought to the game. Love it. But... Am I a diehard Kobe fan? No. No. Am I a diehard LeBron fan? No. But I definitely give them their props. I think I'm not more of a Kobe fan than a LeBron fan. Honestly. But I'm just rambling. Back to the game. Uh, yeah. The Suns, this is what the Suns do. They'll get us all hyped. Thinking they really about to do something this year, just like the Cardinals. They really be tricking motherfuckers acting like they think they gonna do something this year. And then boom, they play like last night. Y'all was up two and oh. Y'all had one job. Keep them oh. niggas. Now y'all two two. Two two. Dos dos. Like, how y'all let that happen? Y'all have the game in the palm of your hand. Even when Giannis scored 40 points in game two. And three. Did he score 40 points in three? Whichever. Y'all, no, it was game two. Because y'all still won. Y'all still won. Even when they start playing, it dropped 20, uh, 40 on y'all asses. Y'all still won. But last night no volcano uh, I think I just said no small I meant to say no boys but yeah <laughs> it, it's it's just it's just terrible they didn't got the Phoenix Suns they got a whole damn thing song rally <laughs> rally for the valley we didn't got a whole damn theme song and y'all played like that last night. Y'all let it jump? Hand? Hand? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. Like, I just don't. I don't. Like, ow. Yeah, so I just don't understand how y'all, how the Phoenix Suns allowed them to do that. See, like I'm saying, this is what the Suns do and the Cardinals do. They get the whole city hyped, so hyped. Like honestly, at this point, I would be surprised if they win. Like super fucking surprised, because it kind of feels like the Bucks is about to run. <laughs> Run back on that ass. Definitely going to a game seven. Now I'm gonna take my elf concealer, hydrating camo concealer, satin finish, satin finish. Um, this is some bomb mask concealer, but I'm running out. Oh, and let's not talk about, what is his name? Crowder. I knew what it was, I was just making sure. Jay Crowder is a 580. All the man did was cry the whole freaking time. Like, Jay Crowder is a crybaby. I cannot, like, he made me mad, like, I was mad. Disrespectful. Excuse the toilet. He wanna be in the video so damn bad. That's why he 
Can y'all toilet just make that random noise? Y'all probably like, this is so ghetto. This video is so ghetto. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm reviewing this. Zero stars. Ghetto as fuck. This, this girl is ghetto. She doing the, her makeup in her bathroom. And her toilet is making noises. <laughs> That's what y'all gonna say. I gotta learn, like, YouTube adequate because this cussing and stuff i need to lord jesus help me help me help me jesus help me but yeah hey crowder needs to get it together now i'm gonna take my fancy concealer ain't got nothing in there so i'm gonna scrape gotta go to the makeup store Great that I can. So I can get to Sephora. And we do not waste over here, okay? Okay. But yeah, back to what I was saying. Jay Crowder, it was all he did was every time that he hit. Every time he got a fell. Sir, get your butt out there and go play. Quick. Foul on Jay Crowder. Somebody barely tapped him in the face. Well, who was it? Giannis? Somebody hit him in the eye. Nose. He ain't get hit in the eye. He. Like, Crowder, get your butt out there and play. Get up, dust yourself off, and regroup. Like, no, you're not about to do this. We not we not doing this. Not this season. We're not doing this. No, no, no. No point on. No point on. I know this is um the Pete Louise. P. Louise primer base, but I need my inner corner to be a little bit wider. And yeah, yeah it's, the concealer mixed with it helps it blend it out. There's no rules to makeup, guys. Like, you can use your lipstick on your eyes, you can use your primer as a concealer. Look at that. Y'all wouldn't even know. Like Don't forget, blending is key. Blending is your friend. You gotta really, as long as you blend something out, and I'm taking my Sasha Butterfoot powder, as long as you blend something out, you stay. Put it a lot under my eyes, so like I don't really care for baking, but baking does help, it really does. So sometimes I would like put it a lot on and just press it in first, and then go back in my powder and put it back on my lids. Chin, which creases my eyes and my chin area creases the most like that should be irritating and my under eye I'm trying to but mostly my chin and my eyes um but yeah Crowder is a fire baby and I I don't like that I don't like that Get it together. Get it together. Okay. <laughs> now I'm taking 
my Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in 40 Dark to Contour. I found this powder literally yesterday cleaning out my makeup bag and I forgot about it. And I like I I still stand by this. I don't I had another one of these, but it was a shade that was more my skin tone. I can't remember the number of it. It was two, I think it was like two shades lighter than this. Maybe three. I can't remember. But this stuff. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. I just, back, back to what we were talking about. The discussion we were just talking. Ooh. Ooh. That's too much. brush my powder brush wipe it off because it got glitter and stuff in it oh I forgot my forehead my nose dip it in the powder Brush it all. I go in circular motions because it blends better. It definitely blends better. Um, I can't wait till I get in a camera, guys. Like an actual camera. I'm just using my iPhone. I'm just using my iPhone 12 right now. These pieces just do not want to stay, like. All I'm saying is, if Chris Paul is going to play like he did, he ain't never going to get on championship. And then Crowder cried the way he cried last night. And five seconds, he, he found somebody. They found him. Shut up. Like, at some point, you just, you just zip it. Don't say no more. Do not say anything. Anything at the end. Okay. the Suns think they're gonna do playing how they played last night like y'all not gonna win no championship like that but I'm not even gonna um, like talk all the shit talk all the stuff to the Suns cause I'm about to get on Milwaukee's head too cause y'all got lucky last night wasn't like y'all really Y'all really was shutting them down because y'all was only one, one, two points apart, like the whole damn game. So, my Mac, like, um, my Mac. Actually, my sisters. <laughs> like, don't act like y'all was really out there balling and acting crazy. Cause y'all barely escaped with y'all life. Make sense to grow this. I don't know, I just feel like those two colors is like, does it for me. It does it. Brush and my homegirl brush got mixed up, but 
We gonna keep it pushing. Take my ladies. I stand by this Sephora Micro Smooth Powder. It puts the finishing touches on your makeup, just seals it like just ugh. Ugh. I just at first shit happened this way. At first it may look like it's not doing nothing, but just it's doing what the heck is supposed to do. I don't understand why half of this brush is wet. Yes, I go over. Honest, for you to be such a superstar, why are you averaging 20 plus points a game this series? Talk about this series, so don't be in the conversation like that. He scored 20 points in game two. Yeah, I know, I know. He still lost, they still lost in game two, so it doesn't matter. Then 40 points do not matter because it did not help them win. They still lost. Like, I mean, 20 points, it's, it's cool. It's cool, but for the star athlete, the star on the team, y'all is great the freak. You supposed to be out there dropping 50 plus. Like, come on now. Blocking shit. All of that. You wanna wait till now to like when y'all two two to start really doing something y'all you y'all only one because y'all was in <sighs> y'all was in milwaukee like anyways the next game is in ac so i guess we gonna see we just gotta see because I don't know. I don't know who's gonna win, frankly. To tell you, like, I'm so thirsty right now. Like, I don't know who's gonna win. I don't even know where I got this, but this is lip oil. This is what it is. Ooh. Forgive my hands. Uh, I'm Makeup bag is dirty. I still have to wash it. So I make up on my hands. No matter how I'm doing makeup. So, <laughs> anyways, <laughs> this is that super egg oil pink shine.
myself early in my life. I just used the end of my comb, honestly, early. It really doesn't matter because the glue can come off. So I think in my next video, like I'm gonna start talking about like, yeah, I just feel like if the sons keep playing me like they playing, it's gonna upset me and my homegirls because I don't even want to win. Curry. But we'll show see. All I'm saying is the Phoenix Suns need to get it together because before they become the next greatest upset in NBA Finals, being that in 1975, the Golden State Warriors whooped the uh, Washington Bullets, four and up. And that was like a big surprise to everybody because everybody, the Washington was the favorite going into the game. So nobody expected Golden State to really do anything. And honestly, I, I feel like a lot, a lot of people are leaning more towards the Suns because they have been playing excellent this whole season. Like they, they, they've been doing their thing. But they better get it together because they catching up. To take my highlights. Fancy highlight, which is also accidentally, really was an accident, sis. <laughs> I was doing my niece's makeup for her birthday, and I used my sister's highlight on my niece, and I accidentally put it back in my bag, and I keep forgetting to give it to her. So, yeah, another fun fact. Um, like I was the NBA. The most watched um, NBA Finals with 29 million views on NBC was in 1998. It was the Chicago Bulls versus the Utah Jazz. Everybody was excited for their finals. Y'all, let me tell y'all, it was the 1998 Finals. The last Finals, Michael Jordan, was ever in the last ring he ever won that made it his sixth ring six uno dos tres cuatro cinco six six so yeah everybody and the bulls had just they just two peated again so everybody wanted to watch that everybody wanted to watch that they wanted to see if michael jordan was going to really put on a show and if the Bulls can't really three-peat again, you know. So yeah, a lot of people was tuned into that. 29 million people watched. Can you imagine having 29 million? Not not even including the the people in the audience because the stands were packed sold out show so you got them plus 29 which was thousands of people plus 29 million people at home watching you michael jordan knew he had to show out he didn't have to show out you know <laughs> He showed up in the finals. I know that was the last time he got a ring because his first rings was from the Pistons when it was Isaiah Thomas, Dennis Rodman, the mean white guy, I always forget his name. Um, when it was all of them. I think they got two rings, yeah. It was 89 and 90. Eight, 1989 and 1990. I think that's when the Pistons won. Then 91 through 93, 
that's when the Bulls three-peated and then Michael Jordan tried to retire or whatever, play baseball because his dad died. And he just wanted to break from basketball, you know, step back. You know, he was tired of being the best player in the world, so he went to baseball. Because him and I, I believe him and his father used to watch baseball together as well. I believe. You can correct me if I'm So everybody was in tennis at that game. So I'm gonna finish off my makeup and change my clothes and I will be back with the final look. I'm back. <laughs> okay, so this is the final look. You know, just a everyday beat, slight beat, nothing too serious, you know. Nothing too serious. Um yeah, well I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will be doing way more videos with me while I'm doing my makeup, talking about sports, whether it's football, basketball, tennis, track. Oh, we're going to get on track. You know, it's, I want my YouTube channel to be a variety of things because I'm not just limited to makeup. Like, I have a lot of talent and knowledge that i want to share with you guys so yeah thank you guys for tuning into the video hope you guys like it and i'll see you next time bye